This is a video of Red Mountain under construction. We've been working on the scenery using the tried and true cardboard lattice method. Uh, this is an area that uh, we haven't named, but maybe Glen Carbon would be a good name. But it's right outside the entrance to the yard, and we needed that area open. And from this point, you'll be able to see through a gap in the mountain at tracks in the distance. And that is divided from the Y that's on the north side of the mountain where the uh, iron ore mines are. Coming around now to the north side of the mountain, there's another tail of the Y. and a view back at the Y. And this is where our work in the last couple of days has kind of ended. And then as we look along the north face of Red Mountain, the tracks up high will be uh, probably two mine tipples. We've shown in other videos. And then at this end of Red Mountain, we've actually got some of the lattice work covered with masking tape. Uh, this is a technique that was suggested by the folks at Model Railroad Hobbyist Magazine. I think Joe Fulgate promotes this method and we're giving it a try. Uh, this will be covered with paint and then also with some special mix of plaster uh, that will form a lightweight hard shell. Now this area is new uh, this is the centering plant and it's also on Red Mountain and is a place where run of mine iron ore is going to be processed. It will be brought in, dumped, run through crushers and sorted. Uh, the original plant was used to manage the chemistry of the iron ore which changed throughout the day. Uh, from different mines and also from different points in the seam. We've also added one more mine spur at this end and I think this is going to represent the Redding shaft mine which was actually operated by Woodward Iron but on Red Mountain. Now we're looking back at the other side of the gap in the mountain at some of the lattice work we've put in in the last few days and we're making some good progress. So it's been a while since we had an update on the Birmingham District Model Railroad. And one of these days you won't be able to see over Red Mountain and see downtown Birmingham. So we've made some progress and we're coming around the mountain and we hope you've enjoyed our video. And there's good friend Nico Young from Nashville who's come to Birmingham to help out. And somewhere back here is Craig Gardner, without whose help none of this would be possible. And there's Craig. And that's a good place to end.